Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a sheep. Pretty much do whatever you want. I've already warmed a couple of these. I'm a little tired. I'm going to show you how to sit these things up. There's a technique you use. If you do it right, they'll just sit there and let you do, the, do your thing. You just grab them. Sit them down, just like that. If you have another person with you, they could trim their hooves, or you can do it yourself, but it's a lot harder. But right here, I can warm them. I can do their hooves. All right, he's about to knock that camera over. Hey, better angle now. Get out of here, sheep. <laughs> yeah, guys, this is how you pretty much make a sheep do whatever you want. Sit her on her butt. They just sit there. It's the craziest thing. I'm pretty sure you can't do this with goats. It's sheep day. What could go wrong? You guys, this one's a little one. Um, they'll get some of the dewormer from their mom, but since I caught it, I'm gonna give it a little bit. <laughs> it's one of the bigger ones. I just gave it like a quarter of what I gave the mama. This one sheep has a big old uh, cyst on its chin. I'm gonna pop it. If you guys don't wanna see it, turn away now. Hey guys, that technique right there, you just pick, get it behind them, grab their neck, set them up on their butt. That's how I warm my sheep. Um, I have a little makeshift corral. I had about 12 of them in there and they got out, so I need to makeshift a better door, I guess. But uh, yeah, I had to pin them up in these. Um, these sheep, I don't have a, a traditional crow. Quick, get out of here. They're rubbing on the camera. You're next. But I got about, I think I got six or seven of them warmed, the ones I wanted to warm. I'll warm the other three or four adult ones I got. You know, it's warming season right now. Actually, for Dorpers, it's always warming season, but uh, springtime, you really need to make sure you get the warmer on them. Get out of here. This sheep just wanting to mess with this tripod. But yeah, guys, I just want to show you that. I had um, one of my sheep had a cyst on its, on its uh, cheek, and I was trying to pop it for you guys, but nothing came out. It popped inside. Didn't hurt it by any means, but I had one do that before, and it was pff, exploded. I was trying to get on camera with this one. Not near as bad. I'm not really sure what's cost. Sometimes they'll nick him on the fence or whatever. It'll get a little cut and get a little bit of infection. And uh, I was gonna, <coughs> excuse me, I was gonna put some blue knot on it, but it didn't open up, so it's fine. I got her warmed. I got, like I said, I think I got six of the adult uh, used warmed. I got two or three more I need to warm. Um, I warmed a couple of the bigger ones, bigger lamb ewes, and uh, they should be good to go. And uh, usually they say you don't have to warm uh, the baby lambs if they're still nursing because they'll get through their mom, which which makes sense to me. But I'm getting ready to pull these bigger ones off their mamas anyway, so I already had them pinned up, so I figured why not just go ahead and shoot some warmer, dewormer down them. But all right, guys, hope that helps you. If you guys are new to sheep, and you're like, man, how do you, how do you handle these things? Get behind them, I grab their neck, get my hand underneath their belly, boom, just lift them up like that. I'll show it to you guys one more time, and uh, you guys will get to him. They just sit there, like that, you know, you do whatever you want to it. I'll show it to you one more time. As long as my sheep don't knock this over get back they're real curious oh 
I'll do it on this smaller one for you guys. Just grab them right here, and just sit them up on their butt, just like that. Then you can warm them, trim their hooves, like I said. This is the best way to handle sheep that I've came across without buying any equipment. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, just ask you please subscribe. And thanks for watching. Went ahead and caught this one too. I'm going to go ahead and shoot a little warmer down it too, just in case. Hate to lose a little lamb from worms. You can use pretty much wherever you can get down their throat. They make a longer um, syringe type thing. And I have one, I just can't find it, so I just improvised. <laughs>